Each time he gets a little closer, each time another detail falls into place. Now the trap works against the Herald of Darkness. Right on cue, bubbling to the surface from untold depths, the horrors come. The emerging monsters do not expect the warm reception that has already been prepared for them. Saving Emma. I guess. Thanks for saving me again. I'd hate to die before I'm scheduled to be murdered. 
I guess I have you to thank for setting everything up at the oil derrick. Yeah, well, I figured that if we were going to go over this again, we might as well try to be smart about it, huh? I appreciate it. You took a big chance doing that. You okay? What do you think? I've died twice. I remember everything pretty clearly now. You said I was gonna be okay. I don't know what happened. Well, it's not your fault. I think one of those, what did you call them? The, the takers? I think they did something to the power and they got me that way. I'm sorry. I got the keys from the dead guy in that room. And I'm not handing them over until you do something about this. I'm sick of getting killed. Fair enough. You seem calmer now. I tried freaking out. Didn't do much good for me. I guess you get used to the craziest stuff. Good for you. Plus, I figured I'd take the edge off, you know? Mm-hmm. Those herbal supplements are pretty good, huh? Oh, yeah. Okay. I really don't think they can get to the power now. Thank you. That's a relief. Um, here's the keys that you needed. Thank you. Hey, I have to tell you. At the diner, I, I went there with him. The guy who looks like you, okay? I know I said that I didn't. Yeah, I figured. The fate of countless individuals hangs in the balance, threatened by the machinations of the Herald of Darkness. And yet, for a moment, the Champion of Light breathes a little easier. He has saved one life. For this moment, it is enough. And soon, perhaps, he can put an end to this. Returning to the observatory for what he hopes is the final time, the man feels anticipation and dread in equal measure. Soon, he knows he will have what he needs. Hello, I was expecting you. I've already taken care of the imaging array, but you should...
Very good. I believe we're ready to look into the sky. Be right there, Doctor.
These things would stop a lady violating the laws of physics in my observer. They're just rude. Are you all right? I'll live. I'm glad. I'll send the lift down to you. I remember our previous encounters very clearly now. But technically, if this really is a loop in time, we've never met before. I don't know why our awareness persists, but it's bloody fascinating. Doctor? You know, I know physicists who would give 15 years of their lives for a chance to experience something like this. I'd imagine that being stalked by horrible axe murderers would curb their enthusiasm a little. Clearly you've never met hardcore physicists. I'm glad you're in such good spirits, but- the Signal! Yes, it's completed! Finally. If all goes well, this should be the last time we go through the loop. You know, I just realized that I don't have any memory of what happens after you leave. What does that mean? I don't think it means anything. If everything goes well, you just keep going. I don't show up here like this again. No more bad... In a strange way, he feels at ease. He is armed with his own words, and when the time comes, they will be enough or they will not. For now, he's content to let the currents take him toward the final confrontation. <laughs>